God, Jesus Christ, shed on the cross to take us. We can talk now to God. Through, through whom? Jesus Christ. Because God suffered for us, for everything. God gave himself for us. <coughs> Jesus Christ is our Savior. Amen. Jesus Amen. Christ. If Jesus Christ did not give in in this world, he did not give his life to us, we will not, cannot, we cannot even talk to God. This Holy of Holies is still there. And we cannot even experience how, what is the joy, what is the good thing that you are with God. Mm -hmm. Amen. For, you know, there is a, there is a one member here before the, uh, in Bible study. Uh, he is a Christian from, uh, still, when he, uh, yeah. Yeah, <coughs> born Christ, born again Christian since and birth. Since birth, and then he couldn't <coughs> check it. What is what? The, what is the changes in his life? Mm -hmm. For us who, who are unbeliever before, we can check what are the changes from unbeliever to believer. Mm -hmm. Rightfully, we can uh, we can check right away that what what has been changed in me. What has been changed <coughs> by God? It's not by ourselves. It is Amen. by God. We should always think that you did not change yourself. It is God changed you. Amen. It is how He changed you is going through His Word by meditating His Word, by going to the secret place. Mm -hmm. How going to the secret place? By talking to Him. Maybe you go to your room. You talk to him, you cry out, it's not a problem. Don't be shy, to be shy that you are crying because of you are talking to God. You should be happy that you are talking to God. <coughs> not any one of us can uh, lie, uh, can, uh, what is it, uh, kneel down and pray to God. I always experience this that every morning I have these morning devotions. That Whenever I kneel down to God, I really, I really cry out to God. I really, I, uh, and there is this feeling that uh, God is really renewing me. God is really starting me, my, starting my days in a, in a blessed day, which is, uh, which is He is the one leading me. Mm -hmm. Amen. It is better for us that God, thank you, Lord, for this day. It is. Uh, it is my Kuya Francis teaches us here that our children says blessing come in in the morning, mm -hmm. which is truly it's happening. Ma Kulina, whenever they go to school, he is he go to the door and say blessing come in before we, he she go out, and it is a, a very good uh, example that each one of us will. Pray before we go out to the house. Amen. It is a very good example and a very good uh, attitude towards God. Because uh, you will start the day with God. <coughs> if you trust your day with God, it means you trust Him. Amen. Your whole day will be with Him. And nothing will be against Him because God is with you. Amen? Amen. What is the true security? Putting our trust in the one who knows all our futures. Trusting God Almighty who cares for you. Do you believe that God cares for you? Amen. 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 Tell your uh, sibling that God cares for you. God, God cares, cares for you. you. God cares for you. Brothers, if you believe that Amen. What your brothers or sisters told you, it is true. God Amen. cares for you. Amen. Amen. God cares for everybody. And God cares for everyone who are here. Amen. Seeking Amen. the word of God. Seeking God and knowing God. Amen. God is our protector. Amen. 
He will save you. He will cover you. You will not you will not fear. Just this example. There's a what's the name? Penguin. Penguin. With a with a chicks. Chicks. See the chicks. Okay. Penguin. It's like a father and mother. Alpha. Taking care. Mother, of father, each other. Brother, if you sister. are with God, imagine this one that God, His wings covers you. A mother will always save all children. And you will not be fear if your parents is there, right? You will not feel fear because protections remove fearlessness. Remove fear, sorry. Protect. You are, if you feel protected, you will uh, not feel yes. fear. Amen. Uh, and uh, if you if you are if you are on God protections, so you are feeling that there's a giant so much with you. Amen. I feel because for all I know, angels are very big. They are giants, mm -hmm. and no one can no one can snatch us because. Amen. With the help of God and with the help of our angels, they are. We cannot do wrong. If what we will do wrong only if we choose to do. There is a choose. And what is it? Choose. Choose to do or you you want to do. If you ask God to protect you or you choose to do this, even God is protecting you. Of course, God will go. Up will not go with you and if you if these things that you are going through is not good because you if you, God is with you you will always have a discernment of spirit you will know good and bad so if you are going to bad things God will not be with you of course because he has given you already the discernment of spirit because God is inside you God is in your heart you know what is good and right what is good and bad. Obey and serve God. Let us read this one. If they, if they obey and serve Him, they will spend the rest of their days in prosperity and their years in contentment. So, if we obey and serve God, we will experience Prosperity in the years of contentment. Prosperity in the years of contentment. Prosperity and contentment. Prosperity in a way God will prosper you. But it's not the way you think. Because God might tell you this is only for you. And you are thinking more. So contentment is there always. You are already prosper, but if you are not contented, you are not prosper. Amen? Amen? So you should think that you are prosper and contentment should be in you. You should be contented at what God has given you. Amen? Amen? And if you think, really think, that God will prosper you. That God